<laughs> so our toast, our first toast here, your name is? My name is Alex, and I am the worst man. Woo! Is this, is this right on okay here? Okay. And I don't want to start with the toast, I want to start with a story about these two. And as you guys know, they met when they were traveling and they were very really young. And they had such a good time out of their lives hanging out with each other. And one day, Andre decided to move to San Francisco to share his life with Natalie. And he was wondering, how would he fit in? How would he fit in with Natalie's life in San Francisco and all of her goings on and her her lovely studio apartment in the Tenderloin. Very spacious, very spacious. And he got settled, he was starting to get settled in, and Natalie came to him very excited one day, early on, the first day, I think, and said, Andre, I'm so glad you're here, and I've cleared out some space in the closet for you, your very own space to share your life with me. And so Andre was very excited. And they went to the closet, which is about as wide as maybe this stage is. A little less. And uh, Natalie opens it up and shows Andre the space that she's made, which is um, about this much space for all of Andre's belongings that he's brought from Australia. And that was when doubt began to creep in. <laughs> So a lot of you were not at the wedding in Vegas, um, and I was the best man there, so that's uh, not really the reason I'm the worst man. I can't tell you that story. But <laughs> Natalie's uh, younger sister can tell you that story. Um, <laughs> Uh, so, so after the wedding, which, which you heard about in the Cadillac with Elvis, and it was a lot of fun. We were in the limo back to the hotel in Vegas, and we were going to have a great time on the honeymoon and go out that night. And um, Natalie said, hey, I'm so excited that we're married, and I want to post this on Facebook to share this event with everyone. And Andres, in his, in his way, says, well, that's great, but you know, like, just maybe could you hold off because if you did that, I would probably lose my job in Australia. I will get fired if they find out that I've gotten married in America. And Natalie says, but, but I've got to post Facebook. I can't win Facebook if I don't post. And so instead of going out, they stay in their room basically all night arguing about whether or not to post to Facebook. <laughs> And that was when Andre knew <laughs> that he found the one to divorce. So, so, um, a toast to a man and a woman who are very single, very, very available, and very single. Let's get drunk and make some bad decisions, starting with Andre and Natalie. I don't know.